What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Big Hands. I hope you guys are having a great day. Uh, in this video here, I'm going to go over a uh, size 7 stack. I'm going to uh, try and link a video in the description about uh, my initial um, size 7 stack. Um, that video, if I remember right, is the long way <clears throat> uh, to stack the deck. In this video here, I'm going to go on the an in the hands version of it. Uh, hopefully this video won't take too long. But to start out, you're gonna need your cards in Ace to King order all the way through. Uh, put your diamonds first, then your clubs, then your hearts, uh, then your spades. Um, one note about Size seven stack is, uh, it gets stacked in a chased order. Um, clubs, hearts, spades, diamonds. Clubs, hearts, spades, diamonds. Even though the diamonds are in the front. Um, as long as they go in that order. Uh, it doesn't matter which one's in order. But as long as they go clubs, hearts, spades, diamonds. So you can cut this uh, after you get done with the stack. And it won't matter. Uh, all this will make sense um, when I get through with the stack. So for this, uh, this in the hands one, it's gonna start with that king. All right, that king is like key. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take the next three cards and stagger them like that, right? Um, and then you're gonna go to the next suit. So after the 10, you're gonna go to the nine eight and seven of the next suit. Looks like that, right? And then for the next suit, six, five, four. Something like that. And then three, two ways. Kind of squeeze all, all this together. Now the hardest thing for me was trying to keep all this together um, and then you just basically start making your stack and what you're gonna do is you're gonna go in chased order right and take the three to six to nine and the queen first then the two five eight and jack and then you can barely see them the uh, ace four seven and ten uh, initially in my mind what I'm thinking in my mind is um, sequentially, you're going to have at least three numbers in between cards. So ace to four is three, four to seven is three, seven to ten is three. So if you don't see that, um, made a mistake somewhere. And then I'm also thinking of spades, hearts, clubs, diamonds, or the other way. Diamonds, clubs, hearts, spades. So we'll do that the whole way through and just keep stacking. Now this ten is the next key. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to the nine. Nine eight seven. Uh, go to the next suit, which will be uh, six five four. Six five four. Go to the next suit, which will be three two ace, and then the next suit here will be the king, the queen, and the jack. Right. So. Uh, I don't know, it might kind of help if you kind of spread these out a little bit as well so you can see what you're doing a little bit better. So remember, um, king three, six, nine. So those will be the, those will be the next ones in uh, rotation. And they go up by three. King to three, three to six, six to nine. And once again, diamond club, heart, spade, spade, heart, club, diamond. Right? And then the next ones. Queen, the two, the five, and an eight. All going up by three. Um, and in chase order. And then for the last one, uh, the jack, the ace, the four, and the seven. Looking like that. When you do take cards out of here, make sure you only take the four. Sometimes you grab one in the middle, it'll go with it. All right, so from this point here, 
we go, we, we follow the seven, then we go to the six of uh, spades. Six, um, six, five, four, looks like that. I'm gonna go to the next suit, uh, three, two ways, like that. Uh, king, queen, jack. King. This is where it gets kind of difficult holding all this together. Um, and then 10, 9, 8. So once again, kind of spread these out a little bit. Uh, you're keeping in mind that these cards going up by three. And you're keeping the, uh, the diamond club heart and spade in mind as well. Those go there. Um, the five, the two, the queen, the nine. Five, two, queen, nine. So they're all, they're going up by three in suit, well, in number, and then the diamond club, heart, spade. See what I mean? I almost grabbed it at four. And then, um, this is what I'm talking about. How hard it is uh, to hold on to this stuff. And then I think we should only need one more. So we'll go for the three of spades. Um, three, two. Look at that. The king, the queen, the jack. King, queen, jack. Ten, nine. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. So, um, 3, Spade Heart, Spade Heart, Club, Diamond. Remember, they got to go up by 3. Um, spade heart, club, diamond, up by three. Spade heart, club, diamond. And then the last three in the back, right? Uh, if you did it right, uh, those are the last four you don't touch. Those should actually should be up, going up by three. And then from here on out, you basically checked out what you did. So what I like doing is, uh, I know from experience, the Ace, the Jack of Diamonds, uh, in my original stack, when I first learned it, would be the last card. Uh, and the size seven stack and the uh, Ace of Clubs would be the uh, first card. Uh, after doing the long stack, Remember, clubs, hearts, spades, diamonds, so uh, three uh, to ace would be four hearts. Um, next card would be a spade. I think it would be seven of spades, uh, ten of diamonds. And then um, 11, 12, 13, all right, king of clubs. And then it would start over. Uh, spades, hearts clubs and then be a three of diamonds or three of hearts sorry but that's basically it um i couldn't find the link where i saw this um stack or at least how they did it this way but i think it's much more i think it's easier once you get the hang of it you know then laying it out i feel that's a long way so uh hope you guys enjoyed this video and we'll do it again